Um, Karen and Bill um, have produced a slideshow for us. We're calling Beyond Words. It is a collection that they intentionally created. And Kathy Hopkins is going to help um, manage this program and coordinate the presentation. So Kathy, Bill, and Karen, thank you all. And let's get started. Actually, I started following uh, Karen and, and, and Bill on Facebook. And I found that I, I would looked forward to their post because they capture the emotions of the time that we have all lived through this fall. Um, so um, during this time, we'll, we'll share the things that Karen and Bill have shared <laughs> with, with others. Feel free to ask questions or react, you know, oohs and ahs are, are welcome. <laughs> um, so we have um, several, several slides here to share with you. Uh, Karen and Bill, do you want to say anything before we get started? Tell us what we're looking at here. Well, we, we take a, a walk locally every day, almost every day, unless it's rainy. Uh, <laughs> and we've been doing this for 40 years. And we have another woodland not far from us, and we walk there. And this is from the other woodland. And these are drawings or paintings that we have made uh, through the summer and fall, uh, kind of trying to keep our eyes focused on what matters to us and uh, what keeps us, keeps us going. This is the oh, view this from is, their window, right? That's right. beautiful. Right. Uh, this wow. is our yard. It's, our, it's essentially our yard. Wow. What we see looking out our windows. Those are photographs. Mm. Oh, 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 that's beautiful. Oh, the colors. Oh, wow. The colors are gorgeous. This is a painting? Yes. Yeah, it's beautiful. Is it the same pond that you see or is it some other place? No. We have another little pond along our rocks. It's, our pond is quite large. It's like three acres. This pond is probably about a quarter acre. Mm -hmm. Off the side of the road in a meadow. Beautiful. Another pond, same mm -hmm. pond? Same, that's that same pond at a different mm -hmm. time. Different mm -hmm. time of year. Oh, the, yeah, it's just lovely. Change. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so many of the things they share with us, the light plays a, a big factor in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. 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 And this is where Ruth Bader Ginsburg died. And it was such a sad time that I, I felt like we had to do something. So I dug a lot of those iris and also a plant called Naked Lady, which are bulbs that they come up in the spring with wonderful foliage and then they die back, the foliage. But then in August and near the time she died, they come up with a wonderful flower. So what we did is we took them to our friends and we took them to a coffee shop and she packaged them up so that a lot of people got the plants. And as we plant them, we're thinking about her and as they come up every year. So it was just something because we felt like we had to do something. I love Iris. idea. Mm -hmm. It is a beautiful idea. Oh, wow. What an honor. Yes. Where do you live, mm -hmm. Bill and Karen? Iowa. Iowa. We live uh, south of Des Moines, Iowa, about 50 miles on a dead end road. And we have a wonderful, we think we live in paradise except the winter. <laughs> then you come to paradise. Then you yeah. come to Florida paradise. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> wow. Look at the flowers. Oh, aren't they beautiful? Aren't they beautiful? Oh, beautiful. The zinnias are gorgeous. It looks like it's taller than you, Karen. Is, yeah. that, is that true? <laughs> it was an experiment to see. We left, we gave them, unlike you, we have incredible soil in Iowa. So things that you, we had to stake them because they got so vigorous. Wow. Wow. Beautiful. 
And Karen's tall herself. So, wow, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Uh, these are some drawings of the, of the zinnias. We had just, we planted hundreds and hundreds of them. And I, I love, I've loved zinnias all my life. <laughs> anyway, they are a great thing to draw and paint. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. That one in the center just seems to have attitude. <laughs> and that is what I think particularly wonderful about zinnias, they're individuals, you know, and they have, they change so over time. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Oh, that's so beautiful. That's gorgeous. Wow. Look at those vegetables. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Look at the uh, ring carrots. Oh. The, one, the ones in the middle I got off Facebook because I wanted Kathy to know that there were lots of colors of carrots. <laughs> <laughs> I did not know that. I all I thought they were all orange. <laughs> oh, no. no, I knew that. It's called rainbow carrots. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the orange carrot actually comes from the Dutch. Oh. And they <laughs> hybridized yep. uh, uh, to celebrate the, ha the house of orange. The yeah. yeah. <laughs> they made, oh. they uh -huh. made an excuse for carrots to be orange. They are among the least nutritious of all of the carrots. Oh, uh, really? Uh, the you hear that? Heard that. Hmm. Wow. Didn't know they were least nutritious. Wow. Hmm. Oh, oh, wow. That's beautiful. Look at that. So color. beautiful. It's so nice to have you folks to share with because we enjoy them alone. And that's what's, what's fun about Facebook. But when Kathy said, could she put them together, we were really pleased. So this is really nice. But we uh, think for sharing it's amazing that is so Very wonderful cute. to see i made a sliced sweet potato recently and i burned it and i'm so glad that i see other people cook it the same way <laughs> the insides come out sweet no matter what the outside yeah <laughs> karen what else is in the bowl with the pecans and sweet pecans i think it's wild rice and pecans and yogurt. yogurt. Oh, yogurt. Oh, my yeah. God. The white is. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see that little dot of yogurt there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Bill, Bill and Karen in Louisiana had pecan trees. I was wondering, do they grow in Iowa? Do you, did you have pecan no. trees? No, no. We have walnut trees, no pecans. Okay. This is after the summer colors, the green colors. Mm -hmm. These are uh, different meadows that I drew. Um, oh, I thought they were one, photographs. The one on, on the no, left. The one on the left is a photograph. Mm -hmm. The one on the right is a painting. Beautiful. You can see and what you meant about the hills. The one on the on the right is a reestablishing native prairie, and mm -hmm. the one on the left is a cultivated field with a waterway through it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. wow. Golden wave like, green. <laughs> yeah, and this is after the harvest. So those, I call them scalps. You know, they cut it almost to the ground. Yeah. Those were soybean fields. Hmm. But the Are, light made it beautiful. <laughs> is it tractor tr tracks or yeah, ridges from the what? Yes. Are they tractor lines? No. What those are, it's done with a combine, a big machine. And out the back of the combine, all the shaft comes. And there's a little windmill at the bottom, and it blows it in two directions. So the dark lines is where there is no shaft. It's just open soil. Uh -huh. So it's not, it's not a wheel. Bill, do they do no-till farming? Pretty now, much or are they still plowing every year? Pretty much everything is no-till because of Roundup, because of chemicals. Um. So that's, you know, that's just part of it. And interrupting and all the, the beautiful stuff this fall was COVID. 
So, and I was trying to handle the idea that so many were dying of COVID, and it's only worse. I couldn't conceive of even one day. It's just gone on and on, mm -hmm. and it's getting worse now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So oh, despite COVID, you have to keep going on. Going on. And there was a, during one of the worst times around the election, we happened upon a Facebook uh, post by these musicians and they were pl playing a song that was called Keep On Going. Keep On Going. On. Keep, keeping Going On and oh. song. And it's on our Facebook if you want to look at it. But it cheered us because it was musicians like Peter that were, you know, in a little tiny house. And they wanted to connect and share their, you know, how lonely and yet they wanted to be connected. And that we have to keep going. And we have to celebrate what we have. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of what my picture was about. So Karen, you're the modern artist. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love both of your work, but I yeah. really, the colors in this are beautiful. Mm. Thank you so much. And, and you will see from time to time, you put the two of their art together uh, and it's just stunning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is beautiful, the golden leaves. Yeah. Oh, yeah. wow. Sometimes when things were, just so bad in the election or with COVID or both. Mm -hmm. We would just go to the woodlands and sit. And this is a place we would go to sit. Oh. And we both think that our work, which is kind of, I don't really call it meditation, but it does take you away from the where you are in the stirring up of the of the contemporary time. It does help. Mm -hmm. And so mm -hmm. this is kind of we're putting out just trying to keep our connection to the real world and what's important. Mm. It's beautiful. Is this on your property? No, this is a woodland not far from us. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. yeah. Mm. That's the same woodland, a different place. Can you, can you walk to it? Yes. Oh, that's fabulous. You know, not easily. It's got, it has paths and trails that you can get to. Mm -hmm. Very nice. So beautiful. It is mm -hmm. lovely. Mm -hmm. Amazing painting. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Those are, uh, it's a photograph of aconitum. That is not the purple in the, in the drawing on the left. That's actually a photograph from our garden. Mm. But they're blooming at the same time. And this is after we've had about snow. four inches of snow. So every, oh. these are the last oh. blooming flowers. Wow, so pretty. And, yeah. yeah, and they're deadly, they're deadly poison. Oh and, uh, <laughs> yeah, well, anyway. Um, and years ago, Martha Stewart in her magazine. Oh, I'm sorry, it was Daphne. <laughs> she put purple flowers on her chocolate cake. And actually that was delphiniums, which are also pretty poisonous, so. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but it's hard to resist those colors. <laughs> no, uh, yeah, that is gorgeous. Amazing. All right, so this one about celebrating our connections. Is this a tea party over here on the right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. I yes. love it. Oh, oh it's so great. I see a glass of wine there and a chocolate cover. Coffee. Something. <laughs> wow. And what we did is this summer we would visit with Mass some of our really favorite friends that couldn't leave their home. And we would bring things and share. And so that's kind of to celebrate that. We had to keep connected or we would just feel like things were really bad. Mm -hmm. oh, I love it. Mm -hmm. Such celebration. Yes. yes. Oh, oh, fantastico. Yeah. 
A lot of things to look are, at here. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, the one on the right is because we were walking along the road, our, our rock road, I started making what I call uh, pictures from the ditch because they were right on the edge where the, the ground is the most compacted and yet things want to grow. Mm -hmm. and, it was just, and, and Bill every day found new flowers because although most of the land in Iowa is cultivated and in monocultures, in ditches, we still have the seeds from the natives. Hmm. So it's just a big deal to find them and enjoy them and celebrate them. So that's kind of what this picture is about. Beautiful. Do you sell your art? Of course. Yeah, it's how we earn our living. <laughs> it's how we've always earned our living. Wonderful. We have, we have a gallery who sells it. We don't uh, you, sell You can yeah, Google right. them. If you Google Karen and Bill, uh, their full names are um, actually in our newsletter. You'll see okay. all kinds of gallery, TV shows. They've done quite a body of work. Wow. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Delightful. Wow. And then mixed in with all the beauty. Breaking news. I love this one. Oh. I love breaking news. <laughs> breaking news. Breaking news. <laughs> <laughs> Great. I appreciate your responses because it was it has been a rough time, don't you mm. think? Yeah, oh, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I realize I had been grinding my teeth throughout the whole campaign and it all stopped. <laughs> but we need to smile. <laughs> yes, we do. In the middle of the mess. <laughs> well, you do know how to bring out the smiles. Yeah. To see wow. the moment characters, it's that's really great. Very times, yeah. Mm -hmm. What is that? Well, on the left is, uh, we went to visit some friends and it's a beautiful <laughs> place in Iowa and it was so still that we just thought it was very calming. But I felt on the right is there's an urban legend that says, you know, if you put a frog in a pan of water and you heat it slowly, the right. frog well, he won't get out. Right. But then when I looked on the internet, they said the frog knows and he gets out. So I think it's like us. We know you've got to get out. You've got to get on. And um, we can't mm. be destroyed by the, the swamp and all the awful <laughs> things that are happening. Good for you. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Uh, oh. Oh, that is so common. Oh, wow. That is so beautiful. Just the simplicity of the art, mm -hmm. but then the statement, too, what our election was about. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No. Oh. I like the that is cat fabulous. in here. I love the cat. <laughs> and the rainbow. Me, too. The rainbow. Yeah. Yeah. It's not all just black and white. <laughs> I love that too. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking about the UU quilt group and how <laughs> to get through this time where everybody is so divided and so Oh, you know, to, be, to imagine getting our world together, we need, we need everything, our imagination and effort, mm -hmm. because it's such a torn time. Yep. <coughs> Speaking of imagining. Yeah. <laughs> stars, kindness, strong, deep roots. Oh. I didn't count them, but 50 stars and 13 stripes, right, Karen? Exactly. <laughs> wow, that is so amazing. Yeah. Love it. Yeah. All connected. Only Karen could come up with that beautiful <laughs> stuff. <laughs> yeah. Only Karen could do that. Oh, wow. I did. Uh, my God. Uh, 
So and this was on, they posted this on Facebook extremely early the morning of election day. Oh, so when I woke yeah. up and I saw their post, I, it was just perfect for that day. Mm -hmm. Is Which this day something that you did on uh, Florida's coast? Is that right? Yes. Yeah, down at um, Indian Rocks. Rock yeah, I remember it. it was really. But you right. used it in the church, yeah. yeah. Yes, and I think I've seen it when we were at the uh, rec center. Yes. Yeah. yeah. It's just beautiful. Just it, beautiful. I love it. And if you look at the banner that's in our vestibule, um, the background behind all the little whimsical, the, the tree and everything, is this edge background. So mm. it's just a beautiful co combination of Karen's work and Bill's work. I think George Ennis would have loved this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I agree. Oh. 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 So, uh, waiting for returns, election. That's day. how it was. Oh, dark chocolate. <laughs> I said if by when Biden won, we could have chocolate. So we bought it and then we had to wait. <laughs> <laughs> wait. Oh, we had to wait. We had to wait five days. And day. you actually let us wait? Did you need to run away anyway? Oh, yes. They're very self disciplined. Yeah. <laughs> well, you certainly captured the mood here that I know we all felt until it was mm -hmm. final. Mm hmm. Yeah. And chocolate is the proper reward. <laughs> <laughs> While you were waiting, you went for a walk in the woods, right? Right. That Saturday morning, we, you know, kept listening to the radio and we went into the woods for an hour and had a really calm time and we came down and it was reported on the news. So we were yeah. like life could go on. Yeah. <laughs> and it looks like it's going uphill. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I am. It's yeah. humpy. <laughs> so there mm -hmm. are yeah. uh. announcements. <laughs> 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 oh, look at the very top oh, wow. John Lewis Sweet. and RBG. Sweet. And when, and when I draw, drew this, I thought I had heard so much that there was dancing in the streets. Mm -hmm. But when I drew the picture, they didn't seem to be all that happy. It seemed to be a stressful, you know, after the election, yeah. it wasn't like it was over. We mm -hmm. were, Bill mm -hmm. called it being spun. We were all being spun, you know, that it's it just like now there is no closure. It isn't over yet. We're still mm -hmm. flailing around. Mm -hmm. Oh, so these are friends of yours, right, Bill and Karen, that you got together yeah. with? Yeah. And nice. the idea was I actually made the cookies before we had enough votes because we were going to come together, but at least we were celebrating that it was going to happen. Right. Mm -hmm. Nice. Very lovely. And this yeah. is how it looks in the winter. Before the snow, oh, yeah. um, the the color is going away. Yes, mm -hmm. it's getting yeah. more gray or color. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And the connection here, the river that you go to. <laughs> yes, uh, that's our river, um, and we're very near the headwaters of that river, so it's pretty small up here. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. But we so, say it goes down to you. <laughs> yeah, it flows into the Gulf. It flows mm -hmm. into the, eventually the Mississippi, which flows into the Gulf, which flows right into Tarpon Springs, right? Yes, <laughs> we are. <laughs> so we are all connected in many ways. Yeah. That's a and wonderful so. way to remember we're connected to Karen and Bill all That's year. Right. Mm -hmm. That's right. And that mm -hmm. is the end. So thank oh, you so much, Karen and Bill, for sharing. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you very, very much. Thank you so much. Really enjoyed it. Yes. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you.
It was wonderful. Thank you. I'm looking forward to seeing That was absolutely beautiful. We mm -hmm. miss you. Thank you yeah. for organizing the photos. And Karen and Bill, we're always thrilled when you share your art with us. So we're delighted to have you with us this morning. And thank you so much for that amazing show. Yeah.